In this video, we have been given a semicircle inside a triangle and angle BAC is 90 degree, BC is 13, AC is 5 and AD is x then we have to find x so in triangle a b c it is a b c a c is 5 b c is 13 and this angle is 90 degree. So, AB square plus AC square, it will be equal to BC square by Pythagoras theorem. And AB square plus AC is 5 square, it is equal to BC is 13 square and AB square plus 25, it is equal to 169 and AB square, it is equal to 169 minus 25 and a b square it is equal to 144 so a b it will be equal to a square root of 144 that is 12 so we get a b is 12 and a b is AD plus BD that is 12 and AD is X plus BD is 12 so BD it will be 12 minus X BD it will be 12 minus X and Now, suppose the center of semicircle is O and if we join OD, then in any circle, radius and tangent, they are perpendicular to each other. So, this angle, it will be 90 degree and OD it will be radius suppose R OD is R and now interangle BDO and triangle BAC we have angle BDO is equal to angle BAC that is 90 degree and angle DBO it is equal to angle ABC that is common so by angle angle Similarity triangle BDO it will be similar to triangle BAC and
now these two triangles are similar hence bd by ba it will be equal to do by ac it will be equal to bo by bc and bd is 2n minus x by ba is 2n it is equal to do is r by ac is 5 it is equal to bo here oc it will be radius that will be r oc will be r and bo it will be bc minus oc that will be 13 minus r bo it will be 13 minus r so bo is 13 minus r by bc is 13 and we have r by 5 is equal to 13 minus r by 13 we have r by 5 is equal to 13 minus r by 13 and if we cross multiply then r times 13 it will be 5 times 13 minus r and 13 r it is equal to 65 minus 5 r and 13 r plus 5 r it will be 65 and 18 r it is 65 so r it will be 65 by 18 and we have 2 and minus x by 2 and is equal to r by 5 we have 2 and minus x by 2 and is equal to r by 5 and if we cross multiply then 5 times 2 and minus x it will be 2 and times r and it is 5 times 2 and minus x is equal to 2 and times r is 65 by 18 and 6 times 2 is 2 and 6 times 3 is 18 and 5 times 13 is 65 so 2n minus x it is equal to 2 times 13 by 3 and 2n minus x it is 26 by 3 so x will be equal to 2n minus 26 by 3 and x is equal to 36 minus 26 by 3 that will be equal to 10 by 3 so x is 10 by 3